Hello, I am 128up, or up for short, and this is the start of my first Let's Play project of one of my favourite games in one of my favourite series. It's a Capcom game that narrows it down quite a good bit. And that jingle is a pretty telltale sign. Yeah, skip the intro. Welcome to Mega Man 7, the only classic Mega Man title for the SNES console. Here we start with Rock and Roll being driven by Orto in a rather strange looking vehicle, um, being driven to the scene of accident. Well, this isn't called the Red City for nothing, is it? But yeah, Dr. Thomas Light, I think it's Thomas Xavier Light, so that may need checking, but oh well, it's quite absolutely trivia anyway, anyway. Um, is going to give Rock and Rush new enhancements to help them ensure that Riley stays out of people's hair. Okay, this scene always made me laugh. Mega Man wearing a Met hat. Wrong headgear, Auto. You were meant to be saving that for Mega Man 10 when you were appearing um, Proto Man Shop. You're three games too early. Good luck, Mega Man. Okay, remind me never to try that voice again. That was meant to be Mega Man voice. Uh, yeah, that was well off. Doctor, are you okay? No, that's why I'm lying on the floor here. Wily is using the attack of his robots to cover his escape. Look! And right on cue! The four robot masters to break Wily out of the You have the worst timing ever, Dr. Light. If you didn't stop and give Mega Man a miniature lecture, he could have had him by now. Go on, fly away to your fortress and who knows what. Follow that spaceship. And at last we get control of Mega Man. Let's see, move left, move right, jump, shoot, charge shots, and slide. And rush coil, but we don't really need it for this stage. Speaking of the stage, this is the introduction stage. Only Mega Man 7, 8, and Mega Man and Base had intro stages. This one being the Wrecked City State now. Great start, I got hit in the intro stage. Um, the Wrecked City, which even has its own boss. Say hello to the Mad Grinder. The Mad Grinder being an intro stage boss is pathetic. He takes 16 hits from the Mega Buster. That will end. See? Simple. Uh, yeah, this is a pretty short stage. There's a couple of jumps, neither of which are that hard. And the end of the stage draws nigh. We just have a little encounter with a new challenger. Ah, the temptation to make the ball joke there was excruciating. He, in this state, will only take nine shots from the Mega See? Not very long at all. You're well, as good as they say. Where did you hear about him? I don't remember him reading any newspapers lately. You better tell me who you are, 
Question mark. So you don't even know what you're on about, are you? And why is your mouth still moving? Ah, Nancy's graphics. <laughs> I'm bass and he's treble. Together we are a troubling quiet. No, no, really. Wait. You're helping us? Why are you shooting at me then? Okay, granted I was shooting back, but that's still no reason. Base? Fish? No. Is the password screen? Being a SNES title it is slightly complicated. But, yeah, nothing too big. And here we are at the select screen. Where the first four Robo Masters await. In this game and Mega Man 8, the game is split in two halves. Part 1 had the first four Robot Master stages, then there was a middle stage, which is kind of like the intro stage, except at the middle. <laughs> I accidentally hit the shot button then. Um, okay, may as well go in and check it out while we're here. <laughs> oh, things I never mean to do. Um, yeah. And after you complete the middle stage, the second half of the game is accessible, and then you have the fourth of stages. This is Big Eddie's shop, you can get it by pressing select. Got a couple of screws loose. Your words, not mine. Um, yeah, this is basically your simple item buying thing. Uh, um, I'll just go through the items for me. Um, one up, self explanatory. E tanks. Well, E cans according to the game, like all E tanks, okay? Um, instant energy refill. Weapon tanks. Refill. Not a weapon's energy, every weapon's energy. Get it right, game. Exit module allows you to leave a stage if you've already beaten the boss, if you like backtracking for extra stuff. And Beats Whistle, for each one of these you have Beat will save you from if you fall in a hole where you should die. However, we don't have Beat yet. We have Rush in, in the form of the Rush Coil, but we don't have Beat. We've got to find it. Yeah, I'm just going to leave, because, well, I've only got 8 volts, so I can't buy anything. Anyway, the first four Robo Masters will wait. Who will I take down first? Wait and see. See you next time. For Let's Play Mega Man 7 The Robot Master Stages.